Hi, I'm Jared Hirsch. Welcome to my home bar, Foolish Whispers. Today, I want to teach you how to make my most famous cocktail, the Caged Heat. Caged Heat is based off of the classic sour recipe. It's two parts bourbon, one part lemon, and one part of my tamarind, cardamom, and ghost pepper syrup. Let's start with the bourbon. I happen to have here a 1978 uh, decanter, uh, Jim Beam 100. 100 refers to the number of months, not years. Um, and so this is 100 months old Jim Beam. It's a little uh, higher proof, it's about 50%. Um, and Caged Heat as a cocktail can stand up to it. Oh, it smells so good. That great vanilla and wood smell that's so classic to bourbon. And so we're gonna do two ounces of that. I collect decanters, I have several of them. They don't always come full. This one did. So that we're gonna get the juice of the lemon. I have a lemon. Fresh is always best. Uh, but have, use what you got. And I'm looking for about an ounce of juice. So we've done two ounces of bourbon. We're gonna do an ounce of juice. And then we're gonna do an ounce of caged heat. Uh, caged heat was born when I entered a cocktail competition with this cocktail. This was a, a I was in the Oaktown Spice Shop in Oakland and uh, they had dried uh, ghost peppers and tamarind paste. And I looked at those ingredients and I said, I can make something out of that. And so I wanted something a little more aromatic. So I also grabbed some fresh cardamom. Um, and I made this cocktail and took it to this competition and we wound up winning the competition. Um, and then put it on the menu at the bar that I manage in Oakland called Sidebar and it became unbelievably popular. And so much so that I had to start a business to, in order to produce more of the syrup. So I'm going to shake this cold now. I like about 20 seconds on my shake, and I like a hard shake. You really do want dilution in your shaken cocktails. I'm gonna go ahead and put that there. Grab ourselves a coupe glass or whatever you have at hand. I like this cocktail served up. That's how I serve it at the restaurant. Double strain that through a fine mesh strainer, but if you don't have one, that's okay too. Go like that. And then I'm gonna garnish it with a dehydrated lemon. Wink. And there you have it, caged heat. I think I'm gonna try some. It is spicy, but not too spicy. It's tangy and tart from the tamarind and the lemon. Sort of balance each other in this crazy sort of bright citrus, fruity place. Um, the whiskey comes through so nicely, that vanilla note, um, that wood note comes through so nice. It's just a fine, fine cocktail. Um, and um, I'm gonna have some more. So there you have it, caged heat. Ugh. Delicious.